It's Fed Day, so let's take a look at those big picture Fed Day techs. We'll probably need the chalkboard, so let's pull that out and grab a pen and take some notes. Okay, so first things first, where's the trend right now? Well, the trend right now is bearish. Remember, we broke that big head and shoulders top, and while we broke below that neckline, the pressure's on the downside, and only back above the right shoulder at 118.80 would change that picture. Now, let's take a look at the levels of support and resistance. The first level of resistance comes in at 117.25. That's a previous low from the 23rd of October. Above there, the next level you want to pay attention to is 118. It's a big figure. As far as the support levels go, 115.50 is the first one. I know we had that weekly low last week at 15.75, but 115.50 is just below there and it's a baby head and shoulders top objective. Remember, off the yearly high, we had triggered that head and shoulders top several days back, which targets 115.50. The next level of support is a big one. It's psychological, 115. A break below there could be significant. As far as the ATR goes, the average range a day in the euro right now is 75 points. So overall, 115 below is the big level. Break below there could expose the major head and shoulders top objective at 112.30. Back above 118.80 will put the pressure back on the top side. 